Hi guys, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can do this sun-kissed, glowy, bronzy makeup look. So basically, like, I'm going to be showing you the easiest and most simple way on how you can do it. So first, I'm going to be using this Ponds Face Cream Serum to base my face. But you can actually opt for a primer like a mattifying or a dewy primer. It's up to you what you would like to go on with as your base. So, but afterwards I went on with foundation. So I used this Maybelline Tinted Foundation or Serum Foundation. Then I applied it using a damp beauty blender. So I went in with another layer of the skin tint foundation. It was a little bit sheer so I just wanted to have a bit more of coverage so I went in with another layer. So I should have went with just normal foundation but I like it because it has some skincare properties in it. So to contour I used a damp beauty blender and the stick foundation in the shade Espresso. Then I went ahead and contoured my hairline. And then I contoured underneath my cheekbones and then underneath my jawline. So I used the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer to highlight. So I highlighted underneath my eyes. Then I highlighted my forehead, my chin, the bridge of my nose. And I also highlighted my jawline. Then I blended out the concealer using a damp beauty blender. Oh, by the way, in case if you are wondering about the hair, like this kinky big afro wig that I got on, this is actually a DIY crochet wig. I've actually posted a video on how you can make this wig. So if you haven't watched any of my videos before, I've actually uploaded this video. So you can actually go on my channel and check out how you can make this wig yourself. But if you are based in South Africa and you would rather just buy the wig instead of DIYing it yourself, you can order the wig from me. So just holler at me through my Instagram or even via my email and just place your order for the wig. Then I can make it for you and send it through to you. So my Instagram and my email, they are both in the description box. So just holler if you would like the wig for pricing and stuff. Then I can make it and send it through to you within a week. So yeah. Then I went ahead and added another layer of concealer just to bring out more of my under eye. I will highlight more of the under eye. And I also placed it on the tip of my nose, then I let it dry down a bit. So to set my contour, since I used a cream contour, I did contour again with a powder contour. That's the Revlon Mocha Powder, the one that I used to set the Espresso Stick Foundation that I used to contour. So and I went ahead and blended everything out using powder. And then I blended out that concealer using a damp beauty blender. Then I set the concealer first using a press powder and then afterwards I'm going to follow with a loose powder. Then I use a powder puff just to press everything in and make sure everything is nice and set. And then I nose contoured using a powder. It's so much more easier to contour my nose using powder. It always come out snatched. <laughs> then I applied a bit of blush, not too much. Then I did a simple brown eyeshadow look. So when it comes to this sun-kissed, bronzy, dewy makeup look, make sure you keep everything in the browns, like your eyeshadow, like just keep it in the browns so that it gives off that nicely sun-kissed, like you were in the sun, you got a bit of like 
some sun kiss or like a bit of a tan or like keep it in the nudes and for shimmer just go with gold or like the copper shimmer or whatever that suits more of your skin tone so i went in with the gold shimmer for the inner corner of my eyes just to add that pop honestly it's my favorite thing when it comes to makeup i love it not gonna lie then i went in with a liquid eyeliner on the top of my lids just to open up my eyes and then afterwards i went in with a pencil uh just on the lower eyelid on, on my lower eyelid this just makes the eyes to be a bit more bright or appear a bit brighter and then i also smoked out the liner using a brown eyeshadow then for eyelashes i popped on this natural mink lashes but first i curled my own natural lashes one thing about lashes for me it was such a hassle to get into like lashes because i didn't know which lashes looked good on me or like what glue to use or like what kind of tweezers to use or how to shape the lashes it was a bit of a hassle and there was a point where like i was on a lookout for a diy starter kit for lashes like maybe like a diy box that had like everything that it's needed for you to start with lashes like that offered you like different types of lashes like a fully loaded lash box that maybe had like everything that it's required for you to get started with lashes like maybe like a range of like different types of cluster lashes that you can try on or strip lashes that are different that you can try on like glue as well like different types of glue and then your curlers, your scissors or like your tweezers that's all in a box like you're all essential for lashes but anyways now i have it available for sale as well you can also buy it from me as well but otherwise i went ahead and popped on the lashes so i used this highlighter palette to bring the glow to this makeup so it has like different shades of highlighter that you can use so i went with the one that matches more of my skin tone and highlighted my cheekbones and i also went ahead and highlighted the sides as well and then i blended it downwards so it's not too harsh and i also highlighted the tip of my nose and then for the lips i used a brown liner to line my lips it's actually an eyeliner but i used to line my lips as well and then i used a brown lip tint and then i used a shimmer on the center of the lips then i set my makeup using a dewy setting spray So yeah, that's how you can do the dewy, bronzy, sun-kissed makeup look. So I hope you found the video useful and thank you so much for watching and bye. See you on the next one.